Okay. Uh, I want another. I want another shot. At the the cockatrice. I had an idea, and the idea is blind. I think cockatrice removes its debuffs periodically, but a that will like take up time from its busy schedule. Um. Of punching me in the face. And B. I don't know if the chicks do. Oh, this isn't the guy. This is the guy who just tells you about the other guys. Interesting. I thought it was in a weird place. I was like, I thought that the other Moogle was somewhere different. Uh. He's blind. Wait, no. I take it back. Come back. Oh, wait, it'll, it's gonna put it in the Moogle. I need to make sure that I have blind. And I guess licenses for blind. My party has got licenses. I assume that Fran does. Okay, I have the license, I do not have the spell. I wonder if poison is good against it. Oh, I don't have the license points. I guess I can get them pretty easily on the way. If I really need to. Um. Oh yeah, because it did throw slow on it. It didn't seem like it made a huge difference, to be honest. I don't know if there's much I need to do here. Go by blind, and I guess poison. Probably for good measure. Seems like it can't hurt anyone. It's south of here. Oh, the magic shop's right here. That's handy. Awful convenient of them. Probably less useful. Is Dark close to me on the license board? Because that says AoE, which might be good if I want to try to fight the the babbies. There's Dark. Uh, it would be a grind, especially if I'm gonna get, go for poison as well. Eh, I'll pick it up. Having AoE seems like it's going to be very useful in the long run, so... Just picking it up now is fine, and... It won't do me too much good while I'm traveling. I say, I'm, I'm probably going to go to the, whatever the next city is where the mines are, and then, uh... Have a bunch of stuff I want to buy, but... Oh well. It's a problem for later. I kind of wish they would make these fellows a different color on the map. As a cute little... Moogle, though. This also makes me... This will make me wonder if, uh... That area resets. I assume that it will now. I, I think it's probably the same rules as, like, chaining. Where if you go through... Like, a major area transition, it will, uh... It'll reset, but if you... Um... If you just move around in the same broad zone with, like, Giza Plains, um, then it'll be okay. Uh, where do I need to go? Yeah, this place. The North Bank, so I need to go east. Which is only one screen away, so it's a pretty quick trip to try this experiment out. I guess I can also just try slapping with my mist attack, the overdrive, whatever it's called. I don't think it'll do enough damage to really matter, because that same thing seems like it's a big mean level. Okay, we gotta play another game now. As I would expect. Hmm. 
But it's a small zone, so I should make a quick look at it. I think I gotta get the rabbits for good measuring. The younglings as well. I feel bad fighting these rabbits that don't hold a grudge against me, but here we are. Just vibing. I don't have like an enemy status blinded or something, right? I assume I can get one later on. Um, I guess I could have looked in the gamut shop. I, I assume that it's something that they only give you much later. As like a cool refinement. It doesn't seem like something you'd want early on unless you're being like a, a great combat pervert like I am. I do feel like the Gambit system is cool, but I don't remember if the game is really like in some ways complex enough to warrant it. Like not, to, not in like a negative way, but just like Final Fantasy combat. It's stuff that you've traditionally been able to manage pretty easily by just, you know, hitting the buttons when you need to. Um, and I don't remember them making it significantly more complex, but I'll be I'll be curious to find out. Even just automating away some of the very simple stuff of like, oh, I'm in an area where a bunch of enemies are weak to thus and such element. I'll use, you know, this thing. Alright, how much MP is, a uh, blind? This probably means I need Vaughn to be on healing. Minus 10. Oh, the smokes. Does Vaughn have green magic? No. Oh, it interrupted. Come on, it. Oh, left and right lets you, I guess, select visually, and then up and down is what lets you do the selection. Uh, I guess we don't, we don't need to run around for this track, do we? We do. Feels like we do, yeah. Hmm. Uh, let's give it a shot. Do I have ethers actually? That's a really good question. I only have a couple blinds in me right now. Okay. I do have ethers. Oh, yeah, and I need to actually learn poison if I don't use it. <laughs> yeah, more green magic. I was sleeping the little babies is also probably pretty good. Um, Berserk seems very useful in some circumstances. It's like the other silence. Uh... <laughs> yeah, Dark will have to wait for another time, I guess. I do also want to see how many babies show up. Uh, that's 
give it a shot anyway. I need these high potions here, to be honest. Alright, do I have to button mash for this? I forget what the deal is. I think I can, like, go into other people's from that or something. That did a grip, but it was not nearly enough. Oh, that's right, it petrifies everybody too. by the bell. Yeah, this still seems like it's, uh... Tough sell. Yeah, even dealing a crap ton up front, we're not there. Fair enough, fair enough. It didn't seem like Blind was taking. I couldn't tell if it was cleansing it. It looks like it can cleanse even... Well, maybe Silence fell off. I don't know how long Silence usually lasts in combat. I would have assumed that Vaughn wailing on it would just reapply it naturally. But maybe it was asking too much. Oh well. Blind is still a good thing to have in the back pocket anyway. I don't remember if they put you up against- again, like, I don't know if there's a lot of enemies that are like, you should really blind this enemy. Um, I'm still mostly in, in baby mode. But, it does look like there's some- Oh, there's a northern exit to the freaking camp that I always forget about. Um, it is nice to see stuff like the cockatrice, though, that's starting to push back a little bit harder. Give me something to look forward to. I'll try it again after I do the mines. I guess depending on how much it feels like I've gotten ahead on stuff like gear. It is kind of cool that the license system means that, like, levels are, I feel like, broadly less important. Let's sign it. You me be. I wonder if you can unlock additional accessory slots somewhere on the grid. That seems like it would be a cool little thing to put in your back pocket. There seems like there's some quite good accessories as well, so having a a way to get them a little bit more reliably would be nice. Yeah, that, that quickening hit for quite a lot, and it did maybe a quarter of its life. So, we, uh, we still need a little bit more gas in the tank. You know, we're, we're figuring it out. I, I just had to check. I thought it'd be fun if I could beat it early. I assume this means that the, the turtle mark that I've got listed in the mines is way off limits. Just forget about it. Pujerbin. Oh yeah, that's where we're going. Pujerbin. Thanks, dude. My leisure craft. That's kind of cool. Slightly tempting. Man, I just want to get a novel. I want to screw around. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I 
the small folk. I'm an awkward translation. That sort of third person thing is like extremely common in Japanese and feels very weird in English. Not really directly third person, but you know, yeah, I guess it still counts. Where is this guy going? Did I just explain what's going on? There's Bosch. Who I will not be speaking with. I assume that they're gonna stop me and be like, Hey, uh, that's not the right aircraft, but I, I wanna see if they let me just go to this other city and I wanna poke around and see how badly things outside kill me. The, oh, Baltier, sorry, not Bosch. Whoops. Oh. He's got that level of reputation as well. I can't remember if this is the game where you have to, like, collect weird sandalwood tokens in one of the cities. I don't think it is. Give me an album We're going the slow way. Will they let me on? Alright! Alright, they give me the option, I gotta check it out. that drink came through. I have um, a little bit of boba left. They give you the full treatment, huh? Pretty sweet. The Sky Saloon. Also, big uh, Ketchi vibes coming off the Moogle riding a... Oh, it's Skull. Is there a card game in this game? I feel like there has to be, but I don't remember one. This game just seems like it is built for one of those like big sprawling challenge anybody you see mini games. Like it just seems totally like a shoe in. What's the sky saloon about, huh? A saloon in the sky. I've got a hunt board in here. Take me to the prison, right? Whoa. <laughs> now I want to find out. What's the deal, Rand? Randy? Obvious charms. Drama at the chief steward desk. Wow, this guy's like, look, I'm coming to you as second choice and you're still turning me down? Harsh, Anne. This dude's a scumbag.
Oh, tight. Going on a, a sweet quest to thwart this dude's gross romantic uh, overtures? Let's go! Oh, it's the stewards of each ship. I see. I wonder if they're also getting hassled by each of his brothers. Okay, there is the city above the... Uh, the dungeon. And then there's a dungeon under the dungeon. A multifaceted place is now been a... Romantics. Oh, Romantics. Very good. Oh, Grim as in like an adjective. I thought his name was Grim. Going for some seven pillars of wisdom action, buddy? I gotta make enough money to get back home. <laughs> I guess I got the teleport stones laid by just in case. What are they selling here? Oh, teleport stones. Speaking of which... Never known I'll need to get some Gissel Greens for the Trocobos. Oh, the normal shopkeeper is busy. That's why the assistant's up here. Sure, man. I thought he was going to tell me about being the head of this cool organization. Oh, is this the head? He's not open for business. He doesn't talk to scrubs. What are they still here? Oceans? Oh, I can! I don't remember this at all. I assume I just teleported around a lot when I was playing before. Where are you supposed to be going, dude? I can't answer your question. You don't answer mine. Poor dude. Built for the ground. Damn. Well, casual racism? Oh, these are like guards, I assume, then. He's wearing the same outfit as that guy by the window. Yeah. Or, like, guards necessarily, but like, crew members. Boonswoggled Bookkeeper. not a lot of in front of the railing to go onto. Oh, I guess, yeah, there's a little, a little lip. Does not seem hospitable, though, yeah, for sure. This is cool. I think I've seen everything I can for now, though. Nap time. Hey, I can talk to the person by the door. I assume they just tell you to go talk to the attendant to get to the rooms. Indeed. Oh uh, yes, her left. All right. Beef. 
58. I wonder if that gets randomized each time. And if they also, I guess they could also have like a pool of captain and crew names as well. Like the, I'm captain such and so with my first mate thus and such. These are cool airship designs. The whole Ivalice setting is just very, very good to me. It's fun hanging out in it. And 12 was like, I don't know, more than I remembered a good place to just be like, you know. Here we are. Living in the world. Good coin. Treasure chest? No, luggage. Okay, so that's the Robin Astro line. Not just yet. Oh, so the whole city's a fortress. And then the dungeons are just like down at the bottom, I assume. Shai Banga. I don't know why, but him just peeking over the the uh, railing like that is pretty funny. This is the same family, I assume. They followed me. Now they're going on another trip that the kid's complaining about. Where do these ones go to? Oh, also the Robin Oster. Wait, this is the desk I looked at earlier. I thought I popped out next to a, uh, a counter with a person on it. But I seem to have been mistaken in that. Oh, here's something. Oh, this is like the the docent. Okay, let me dive the last couple people in here. Rough. Oh, sky pirate time. It's not ring a bell to me. I mean, I haven't played this game in so long, so not a lot is gonna ring a bell to me. Quite honestly. Take me with you. I wonder if that means I can't really leave the city as well. It's gonna be like in uh, Robin Oster where they're like, oh, yeah, you need a special writ of whatever. That would be now Fortress. Oh, this is where the treaty is gonna get signed. before the judge put the kibosh on that. Oh yeah, and of course it's under reconstruction because it got blown up a bunch in the war. Now they gotta put it back together. It's like an elaborate introduction to it though. Especially for it not even being like, oh, you're here for plot reasons. It's just like, yo, you just showed up here? You took the airship? That's so cool. This game is sweet. Let's see if I regret not having any money now that I'm here. Antiqued armors. Took like basically everything I could buy back in uh, Rabanasta. Let's get a list. That's got a whole fucking life story to tell me. I wonder if the city gets finished over the course of the story and you can visit the rest of it, or if it's just always a little... What is going on over here? Oh, it's a seek, like, collapsed. Ah, I see, I see. Alright, dude. Woohoo! Making pig noises. We got dude. 
Yeah. All this seems like it's as I would expect. Stone Basin? <laughs> it's not even like part of a cover or a heist, they're just like, yeah, somebody just started offering us work and we decided to take it. Imperial? Boxes. Box salesman? Boxman. Box of your finest boxes. Grim appearance. There's more fake stone masons than real stone masons out here. It's not making us better people. Okay, you can't really do anything new. I see. That explains why they let me come here. Well, it's still cool to see, and it's fun that they're like, hey, look, it's Nalbina getting reconstructed after getting blown to bits in the, uh, the fighting at the border. Oh, wait, I can go that this way. Aha! Wait, this is a fight! There's a dragon south of the Imperial Capital? Oh, maybe the capital is where you go and you have to do the weird sandalwood wandering. Hey, a teleport crystal. Oh, I wonder if that's the guy I met in there. I don't remember his name, but... Will be. Lost a war with the gods? That was the Gambit Shop. I always think that this is the teleport crystal. What do you got, dude? Yeah, they don't have foe status not equal to blind or whatever. Maybe one comes later on. It is cool that you can have people stop attacking sleeping enemies since I assume that that wakes them up. Oh, this guy again. Got Technics out here. Troublesome Technics. <laughs> nope. Ouch. Dang, it's still expensive. Gotta be really out there for Technic Rebander. Technicery, yeah. <laughs> A resounding endorsement. Bakunami. Nabudis. I do remember that. Vaguely. The name rings a bell name. All the usuals. Yeah. I've bought up a lot of freaking magic, huh? Oh, Nabudis got glassed. has seen it all. Okay, so I can't get the teleport crystal here. I assume they strategically want me to not be able to come back here later on. Oh, never mind. What do I know? Maybe it's just that you're supposed to not be able to get into the, uh... 
the door later. Or into the fortress. Like, they, they'll let you get to the, uh, the surrounding countryside. They don't let you inside. What is what is that? King and Lord Raslin. Holy oh, smokes. Rich for my blood. I didn't see a map moodle. Alright, let's go to the Estrosan. I wonder if I can see what's going on with the fairy. Inquiring minds want to know. They tell me this game has a main story, but I don't know if I believe them right now. I spent all my last time going, uh... On hunts. Yeah, this is all still handleable. For sure. So we'll go check out the Mossborn Deadlands or whatever after this. Your license points are all good to me. Oh, this goes to... I could have walked to the Albino Fortress? Just missed out on that, I guess. What's up there? I don't know. I also don't know. Okay. Well, good to know. I say. Alright, I guess we're getting back on the airship. Well, worth a shot. I was hoping for a slightly bigger detour, but just seeing this is pretty fun anyway. going through thing. My bad, my bad. Very faintly, I think, so. All the way, my bad. My partial bad. Now, the Robin Oster is right here, right? Yeah. Does this count as a different route? I assume not. I'm guessing that it's like there's six, uh, there's six cities and each to and from is just counts as the same crew. Oh, but this lets me see if my room changes. And if the, I don't remember the captain names. I can look at the VODs, I guess, and see if they switch. Oh, but Ostra sounds different. So maybe it is only three. Uh, three cities, and then it's each direction is a is a different like, line, quote unquote. Well, let's start with the thing that I need to do. Is talk to the chief steward. Maybe this is the same. Yeah, that is Anne. 
charming woman. Oh, he's like gossip or like, you know, chatting. I just did actually figure his drink. It does seem like it's so it's I think it's different passengers but the same crew, which makes sense because all the people on the flight to Nalbana were like, "Oh, I'm going to work at the place or whatever." A lot of Imperials going to Provenos. I guess it makes sense. It just got conquered, so they're all coming to see what's up. I kind of wish that the Imperials looked a little different. I mean, you know, maybe it's like we're all, we're all the same at the end of the day. No doctor. Who's out on deck today? Like a UFO guy? Oh, yeah, that makes sense then. Preemptively dressing the part. Makes sense. Girl looking at this guy. I'm clear. Also, these are Imperials, not. Oh, the airship has these weird little rings. I guess that's probably why the aerodrome has that icon. This is probably the girl strength sky. What up? No, she's just literally enjoying the sky. Can't blame her for that. Out here, her, what, the heartbreak feels good in a place like this? Yeah. A new story for me, Barman. Oh, he has like different stories, probably predestination. Makes sense. It is a different number. I was in 58 last time, still in the B's. But I assume that there's a little bit of variance there. Nifty. I wonder if there's like a hunt that you have to ride an airship to find or something weird like that. That'd be kind of cool. You gotta go like talk to somebody on deck and they're like, oh, look at that thing over there. And then it like spins up a battle zone on deck. It'd be cool. I have no idea how the engine would handle that sort of thing. If it's like, Town zones are different. I think town zones are designated differently because you can't enter like the little targeting mode like this. Like I'm hitting X now. And I would assume that man, fucking noisy armor. Um I would assume that that's because the whole area is like we decided this isn't a combat zone. The sky continent. Or stillness. Oh yeah, what does this have to do with Ash again? Kojirba. Bro, I am an orphan and a street urchin. What do you think I get out of dumb mask all the time for? Back to the safety saves. Oh, that's right. Pinello got kidnapped. 
Who took Pinello? Do we know yet? I don't know if we do. This is what spending three hours hunting and side questing will do to you. Whoa. This is a straw. Airship in our for you. Oh, the straw. You really are a sky pirate. Well, the headhunters seem to think so. What's a good word? Is she ready? So is she armed? How fast is she? Could she take the free? I suppose I could tell you, but. Wouldn't you rather see for yourself? Hmm? Yeah. I like that Balthier is like, on the one hand, damn, I got a babysit, but on the other hand, like, I get to show off to this kid who doesn't know anything. Of course. The shortest way, Silvador Stonis. How flies, Bujeba? Oh, she's free as can be, for now. The Empire took notice when they announced the princess's unfortunate suicide in your untimely execution. If it becomes known that I'm alive, the Marquis will lose their favor. I try to steer clear of such things. Right, it's time to fly. And no wagging tongues or you'll like to bite them off. I'm coming, Penelope. Because it wouldn't have been the Empire who grabbed her. They obviously wouldn't have taken her to Ujerba. Uh... I feel like we just got some like, weird ransom note or something. Oh, it's got cool fold-out wings! The straw is so cool. Airship design in this game in general is sweet, and the straw is a, is a particularly good. They hit. They did it. They really did it. We get to see what Penel's up to in the meantime. Indeed. Is she with Ash? I don't remember. You seem to our feeding, yes. Oh yeah. She eats well. We did know that it was these guys, I think. See that she does. We need her alive. Balthier's bait must be fresh. I keep trying to tell you. I barely even know who Balthier is. My brother, a message come from Ravanaster. The Strahl, she sets sail. She makes straight for the sky city of Bajerba. Barely know, was it? Yet out of trace, he goes bounding off for you. Tell me, how could that be? Huh? That's what I'd like to know. I just met him that one time and that's Does it. Does that never stop? What if we plucked it from your head? As for you, we need Balthier alive. His corpse fetches but half the bounty. A tender beaten, my specialty. There's no fun for it if we can't tease out a scream or two. <laughs> Where are you? I'm working on it. I said to do some hunts first, all right? I was uh, building up strength and uh, economy. Yeah, that's my story, and I'm sticking to it. I had to go through a training arc of getting my ass beat by a chicken. I was going to say, this looks a lot like the, uh, the loading screen. Not the loading screen, whatever you call it. The title screen, that's it. Indeed it is. Ooh, new game. Load game. Easy. No good, he's not here. Keep searching! This way! You're a dead man. Don't forget it. And no names. Of course. Can you take an airship from here?
Oh yeah, it's Imperials wall to wall in here. Oh, okay. No, no airships will be taken then. Swagatop. Oh yeah, that guy did mention there being guides all over the place. Oh, and they can hand wave teleportation not being a thing for certain parts. Fair enough. We can do backup save. Also because a friend of mine was talking about having a bunch of saves scattered across a game in case they wanted to revisit a part of the game in particular. And that sounds cool, so I've been trying to adopt the practice. Well, Moodle's made the city, huh? That's cool. I wish the Marquis was a Moodle. I don't think it is, but it'd just be funny to me. Explains why uh, Walthier had a Moogle crew working on this thing. These guys again. Everywhere I go, I see his face. For a kid? Closures going on. It's a good question. Oh, nose. Oh, rip. Rip Bozo. I still register that save crystals or that teleporting crystal, so if I need to teleport back here later, I can. Although I guess an airship costs about the same as teleporting, so it's mostly useful for getting out into the uh, the boondocks, I would assume. Oh, now we get the Bujerba intro. That's cool. That's cool. Sky City of Bujerba. The Lusu mines are just up ahead. Though, I do hear there's not much left there these days. You're on your way to the mines. We're drying up. Oh yeah, that's Then good. please allow me to accompany you. I have an errand to attend to there. This is the Marquis. What manner of errand? What errand? I might ask the same of you. Right. Come on then. What? Excellent. Do me a favor and stay where I can keep my eye on you. Should be less trouble that way. For us both. Oh no, this has got to be the like oh, the diplomat or something. I, uh, I'm, I'm Lamont. Don't worry. I don't know what's in that mine, Lamont, but you're in good hands. Right, Bosch? You're a damn it. Mon doesn't even know, he's just like, damn, I'm smooth. You were just told. I guess they probably should have coordinated fake names to help avoid goose like that. Castel. Little Batman sound effect. But I have to assume that, yeah, this is like a, an Imperial something or other. And that's why the imps are all up in arms.
I mean, it helps when they aren't, like, the governing body, so they can't just put the boot on your neck. We still have our medicine, right? Did we give it to the guy? Nope, it's hanging out. That's pretty good architecture, though. They do seem to love an arch in uh, Bujerba. Oh, hey! I would indeed like to buy some maps. Ooh. Let's see mine's a little rich for my blood, though. Probably hawk stuff to get blue for it, to be honest. Bodge is like foreigner, I assume, or is it just like buddy? Hey, buddy? Or so they say. <laughs> Sign a cop. Um... I, uh, I figured that one out. Wow. Salesman on blast. Nobody wants to be here. It's tough out there, huh? We have some leather shields. There's a few new tricks in here, it looks like. Sally? Buckler? What else can I probably get by with that? I guess I can't sell the stuff that's equipped to people, so I'm kind of safe from accidentally shooting myself in the foot in that way. I will not explain my decisions. Refuse. Oh, where's South? Okay, so the Marcos is up that way. Yep, makes sense. There's guards there telling me to fuck off. Guards there telling me to fuck off. Got it, got it. Messages being received. Processed. Amba must be mother, right? Raxas. Oh, there's a cool demon in the mines. Or so this mom says.
I will mostly rely on the blocked roads to direct me in the right direction. Uh-oh. <laughs> Bro, no! It's crowded in here. That's cool. As long as your everyday is weapons. Fair enough. Paravir. Oh, guns are good anti armor. Okay, so there's like physical damage types that can factor in as well. Interesting. Ah, maybe that's the wife. Unclear why she's excited about weapons then. By her own admission. Why do I need this? We got some goods. I assume this means we don't have licensees for any of these though. Evis Killer. Oak and Pole, not playing. Oak and Pole out here to do work. I feel like stuff like staffs have to have some hidden, like, magic boost thing going on that they just don't tell you about for some reason. I don't have a staff. I only have a, an oaken pole. If I find a staff, I'll try and put it on. Tell me about the blockade. It's like, they're doing my job, suckers. Just gonna tell me to go south, you know? To say hi to all his friends along the way. Beats magic. Checkmate. They do have some new stuff here, though. Why are all these shops weirdly horny? The Brady, yeah. Urban planning. What a absolutely classic excuse. Keep those excuse guns in the holster, my friend. Think about the shot. It's, it's got magic in it. have a sudden burning interest in magic. Oh, hey, magic. Hmm. Hmm. 
Silence seems too good to pass up. Oh, I forgot to buy the freaking map. Oh, I'm gonna go back and get that in a second. There are a lot of clerks. Mine's going down the well. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna go buy a map before I forget. I went to sell things and then looked at the things to buy as well, and then... The rest... Is history. Come back, cartographer. I beg you. Exactly enough money. Perfect. That's right. I, th I don't think you come to Bujerba a lot because I think the mines are basically the only thing here. It's not like you can go because like it's not connected to the landmass, so you can't you know go wandering in other places. It's a very helpful thing for them to put out. Miner's end. Oh, there's a, another area. New sky grounds. I'm listening. That's the guy I already talked to. He just wandered. He's roaming. The day workers. Yeah, should we be going in there then? Hmm. I'll likely start. Oh, they got new techniques in them? Brutal. Can't get no charter. I mean, to be fair, first aid, probably not the most useful. Bam! You got one of those faces. I've seen your face before. What are you selling? Horology. That's cool. Is that time spent in game or like? I guess it must be, right? Oh, I'm getting, getting mixed. It's also fun how they, I mean, I think they just use the same floor layout basically for all those shops, and then they just uh, do stuff like blocking off floors and adding a bunch of uh, little knickknacks to differentiate them. Nice and cute. Yeah, where are you gonna grow things? You live on an island. Import gaming. Gambits here too. I wonder if they got cool new gambits. I can probably afford at most a gambit. What's that move do to you? Oh, 
half tennis. America. on blast you get your king assassinated and see how cool you feel these soldiers are cramping the vibe yeah, I was going to told me about that I know uh, wait how do I the mines oh yeah that's probably about the gumbit shop Or Stonus. Makes sense for a big tourist trap. Wind essential. It does seem weird for Gambus to be, like, a diegetic thing, basically. It's like, we need a plan. We need a, we need a magical way that we can all communicate our intentions to each other. Oh, this is a Seek Shop. Nifty. Probably very under extreme difficulty. What did he say? Oh, he wants to ask me questions too. Oh, it's uh, a bunch of Sikhs for, like, for clerks, but then there's a Banga running it. All business as usual, it's like. Just thought I'd ask. I do think that there are more exotic Gambit options that they introduce later in the game, but... Obviously, they'll just keep it simple for now. And be like, yeah, as soon as the people get poisoned, or poison other people get poisoned, or whatever. Hmm, if only we had a uh, full Imperial friend. Oh, do they have a tavern in here? I guess that makes sense that they would. Does it have a hunt board by any chance? We'll have to check after all these materials get out of the freaking way. Oh, is there shenanigans? Believe me, I have been in the land of mimics. No stranger to the mimic am I. Right, can I snoop on this guy? Lamont? These licenses? No. Okay, what's he got? Fine. 
This doesn't show equipment. Weird. Uh, I'm gonna take a break for now, and come back later. Or like, all right, that made it sound like I'm stopping, but I just mean I'm gonna take like a five or ten minute break to walk around and stretch, and then we'll do the mines.
All right. Time to go to the mines. The content mines, that is. Parivir. And just let me roll up. We gotta sneak in. And we got like a sky pirate and a thief. I feel like we should be. I guess we have two sky pirates. Frank has a sky pirate. The I shouldn't mines. be acting like she's not a sky One pirate. One of the richest veins in Ivalice. Under Imperial Guard, no doubt. Actually, no. With but few exceptions, the Imperial Army is not permitted within Bujerba. Well, shall we proceed? <laughs> Get schooled. Bosh. The one person, really, whose name we needed to not say. It seems like Balthier has enough of a reputation that he's he's just kind of like a... If people know who he is, they're going to know who he is. But... Basha... Basha has an extremely strong investment in making sure people still think that he's dead. L'amour? As they established in the scene where they were like, don't tell anybody that this is Bosch. People might not know what he looks like. Oh, more judges. Yeah, Lamont is definitely that guy's kid, right? You will forgive me for asking, but you are diverting the purest of the Magicite. I can assure you it reaches Lord Vane most discreetly. Ha! <laughs> you wear your saddle well. Damn. Be that as it may. I have no intention of being bridled, Your Honor. Oh, maybe... Then you prefer the whip? Stubbornness will see not only you broken, Excellency, but Bujerba as well. Dude, help. Please, please, praise the guy, I beg of you. Who are these guys? They got little bunny tails. Pali Mondor the Fourth, the Marquis of Bujerba. The family the resemblance seems... The mediator at the negotiations of Damascus' surrender. It would appear that he is somewhat less neutral now. They say he's been helping the resistance. They say many things. You're certainly well informed. Who did you say you were again? What difference does it make? We have to find Penelo. And Penelo is your... She's a friend. She was kidnapped and taken here. He just runs away. Like, I, I get why, broadly speaking, but <laughs> it's just good to feel. Like I'm gonna tell you something, and then just jog into the distance. Alright, what kind of enemies we got here? Alright, let me look in this direction first. Before we go fighting enemies, alright. All right. Flying enemies. I assume bows are meant to be good against them. Is Lamont kind of cooking. Yeah. I wonder if this is consistent. Yeah. Oh, maybe I should make a gambit that's like if something's attacking you, attack it back. Otherwise, attack the thing that the party leader is fighting. Uh, I feel like focusing enemies down is probably more effective in the long run. Windstone. What are we looking at layout-wise in here? Now, that, since I, I paid good money for this map... Okay, so both of these little offshoots go to the same place. Fair enough. Didn't put any treasure down here. Ooh, a skeleton. Hello. And a chunky. Alright, good to know that that's on the table of things we gotta deal with. Seem big. No clear indication of where we need to go, whether it's east or north. Maybe there will be a blockade somewhere to tell us. Yeah. 
skeleton did kind of slap. I assume the hunt is in one of these directions as well. But again, based off the cockatrice, I cannot imagine that string with a giant turtle is really on the menu for us at this juncture. It's a skeleton that's making this walking noise at us. Yeah, can I heal them to death? Asking for a friend. Okay, I didn't even target enemies with Kira. Fair enough. They cast magic. Rude. Wants a high potion enjoyer? Say no more. They cast all sorts of magic. Wily Arcane Skeletons. Feel it? Yeah. The buzzer beater. Oh, there's no point to come down. We're just killing for sport out here. Oh, there's traps? I wonder if I can see this because of, uh... Oh, treasure. Oh, maybe treasure. Treasure indeed. You can't disarm it? Okay. Oh, yeah, speaking of things to tell us where not to go. Wait. I need that. Hmm. Let me sneak by here. Yes. Uh. I missed something? Doesn't look like it. I assume that that switch would open that gate. But the switch does not appear to be cooperative. You don't need me to step on this trap, right? Well. Problem solved, I guess. Okay, so party members will walk on traps. I just have to be careful of that. I have to respect the option. Uh, hmm. So we can backtrack. We need to turn the lights on? Like a power switch in addition to the switch switch? We need to exterminate all bats? Oh no, we need to come down the other hallway. Okay. Yes. I... I get my misunderstanding now. Ask taking bats. Delicious high potion. And it's free! It's all free! Oh, bats can move the ceiling. That's cool. Skeletons can live underground. There's ambush potential going on here. And more traps. I do remember this area. For some reason, I don't know why. It feels like this is deep in the brain. Let's get this guy. Snippy. I'm thinking you. I'm figuring out. Rip chain.
I just to let you avoid some of the monsters at top. Poked him. So while Mog will potion himself at the slightest at the slightest sign of inconvenience, but only high potion party members. If things look a little bit dire for him. Get characterized. Oh yeah, so you can avoid enemies, but you run the risk of that. Oh yeah, I want to see if Libra is what's showing me this. Survey says yes. Dangle the real MVP here. Like there's probably supposed to be a drawback for heavy armor, right? I don't know what it is. Just like the weapons, it's like this seems like there's something that should be going here. Maybe I can look for the uh, for the manual online somewhere. This feels like the kind of thing that they would outline in the manual. Of, like these things have different uses for X, Y, or Z. Uh, I guess let's try going west. It's the shorter route. Eh, not by a long shot, but just decided to go west, so that's why we're going west. Oh, maybe not. The door says. Do not go west. West is not where you belong. We'll go say hi to the door anyway. Beat up some skeletons along the way. I was just watching his friend get beat to hell and he's like, don't worry guys. I've got protect up. Oh yeah, this is good. This is guy is probably good to uh, silence. I say he's immediately like, "Hey, check out this technique I know." Dark moat. Just a little moat of darkness. Killer bow. That sounds useful. I probably don't have a license for it. I do have a license for it. Yeah. Holy smokes, it is not joking. It takes its name extremely seriously. Welcome to the party, Fran. Where's this go? This is a little weird arm. Wait, does this take us past the... No, this is going the other direction. I was going to say, does this take us past the Western Junction? It extremely does not. Uh, let's do this just for fun. Oh, wait, do I not have the license for silence? Looks a lot like it. Wait, I can solve this in real time. Uh, I can barely solve this in real time. I'll get dark later. Oil. Oil seems hilarious. I have to imagine that it's quite good. Uh... I was gonna AOE us. Good work. So then I'm struck the homies. I was like, you got this, Lamont. That's on you, buddy. Uh, it doesn't look like there's any reason for us to go down there then. Even somebody's bloodthirsty as me doesn't want to just walk down a hallway to see the other side of it. That's not really blood thirsty. Explore thirsty? Map thirsty? Something like that? Um, what's out of here? Oh, we can go down this way. The other way. So this is the same trick that they had us do in the small part over here. But now we have to do the same thing that away. Oh yeah, so we do- I, I see. This is all one connected route. I didn't realize that that big little- or that big like tunnel-y mine area 
in the north was like you have to go all the way through it. Well, you don't have to go all the way through it. You can go up on the little detour, which I'm definitely gonna do. Um, but it's like required to do the dungeon. So the dungeon's linear. It's just linear in disguise. A very, a very faint disguise. Okay, good money for silence, and I'm gonna use it. All right. Understand this. Oh, good lord, it's like a freaking skeleton bonanza out here. Oh, they just keep happening. Phoenix down. Took my time. Oops. Stabilized to the point where Lamont can high potion tank us through it. And I think these all count as family members, so I don't think I'm screwing my chain up by fighting the mages and the soldiers at the same time. Come back. No! I guess it makes sense that they would expire, but I just didn't think about it. Oh, Lamont's kind of whippy. He's got infinite healing, which is very good, but... He's not... he's not the beefiest line around. He's kind of susceptible to getting bursted. More up here? I really should have gone down. With a delicious chain bonus. Gravy. Get combo Vaughn, help! Yeah. Sure Lamont is there. Yeah. We just barely keep missing on those, uh... Thanks. I wonder if the manual also explains, like, how aggro works, if there's a way to dependably get certain people to tank. Wait, there's a dude over here. This is pretty lit for chaining though. I actually assume that if you go in and out of this place to respawn the enemies, you could probably get a good chunk of chain from, uh, from the wall. Oh, my friend. Poison just whip, that's brutally mean. Okay, okay, okay. weapons that are like better at comboing too. Oh, that's 
gonna get saved by the boy. Like, daggers seem like a natural, like, this is a good comboing weapon weapon. And there's probably weapons that don't combo, but deal big single hits. I mean, you can already see that with, like, different weapons take different amounts of time to swing. I can easily imagine them. Can like, we heal now when we get chain kills? No joke. I kind of want to go back for another round just because it's fun to have big chain number. There's no bats to screw things up out there. Will they respawn if I come back? Let's just find that out. Uh, let's fight this guy first. I gotta make all the money back that I freaking spent. Dark screen. Hopefully we can be a little bit more cautious. Pulling them all is a pain, but I guess it's also because they hide underground, it's hard to get just a couple of them at a time. As the temptation seems like it would want to be. It's like, oh yeah, you just pull one or two of them with magic. Out for the races. There's some left for sure. Feels like many fewer there. I guess I should also go see if there's more of them downstairs. He parried with his hands? Chain level. Bone toss? Damn. Wow, he tossed the freaking bone for sure. Yeah. Let's get his gaming. Their physical attacks kind of hurt too, to be honest. Like, I silenced it and then it's just like, that's cool, man. Blind might be good against these guys too. They do seem like they're just kind of slapping. I missed. I guess I should probably blind the one that I'm planning to not fight. Or like, that I'm not focusing. I have changed from doing it. I'm not, I'm not planning to max it out here. It's more of just like an idle curiosity. I'm like realizing as I'm sitting here. All oh, the mid mid cast silence by the mage masher. Let's go, dude. Oh yeah, so it must be like milestones of chain give you heals. That's kind of nice. I guess that's especially nice if you're fighting things like this that are kind of like close to your level, so it saves you a little bit of resources along the way. It's what alerted me. So the trapped treasure chest. I'm good, thanks. I'm okay. I'm a-okay. It's just not as many things the second time around. Still a couple guys. Oh, and these guys are still dead. Okay. This is them trying to teach you about Shane now. They're just like, well, listen, when you fight all these guys, you get a sweet bonus. It's still just a bone fragment. I guess their drops are just not that good. I mean, if they're like, look at this cool thing. 
Oh no, you don't need to go up to the north there. Okay. I'm still gonna go. You don't need to. I'm gonna just chill here and have... Oh no, people are gonna charge in this turn. I mean, Lamont certainly would, but... Once I start attacking, then everybody's gonna start attacking. And Fran goes too slow to, like, pull reliably. If those is slows. Skeletons? I guess the, uh... Oh, there is self-status stuff. Dual gambits? An assassin's there. Ooh, hello. I guess I kind of need that to be a big upgrade, though, if I'm gonna... leave, uh, silence on the table. I think that's fine. I'll accept that. That's big enough for me. Chopper. He put a chopper. Out well, there, just languishing with a bajillion license points. Sorry, dude. This is your life now. Now I'll start saving for magic allure. Some like useful shields to be able to equip. If I had any of them. It's also stuff I'm pretty far from being particularly caring about. I assume spears are all two-handed weapons. Fran is perpetually item locked. Or er, license locked because she's wearing some commander. Hmm. A cutscene bodes ill. Is this where it's supposed to be? I guess so. I wonder if it would have been closed if we tried to go the other way. This is what I came here to see. Oh yeah, what's that? Kid. It's nethersite, manufactured nethersite. Nethersite? Unlike regular magicite, nethersite absorbs magical energy. This is the fruit of research into the manufacture of nethersite. All of the hands of the Draclaw Laboratory. What a normal thing for this person to know about. So this is where they're getting the magicite. Errand all attended to then. Thank you. I'll repay you shortly. No, you'll repay us now. We have too much on our hands to go on holding yours. So, where did you hear this fairy tale about Nethersite? And where did you get that sample you carry? What do you know about the Draclaw Laboratories? Tell me, who are you? Balthier. You kept us waiting, Balthier! You slipped away in Nalbana! We missed you! Always got a sweet boy. chainsaw? The whole affair has a smell of money about it. I may have to wet my beak a little. Keep your snout in the trough where it belongs. This thinking ill befits you, Bagamnon. Balthier. <laughs> Too long have I gone unpaid. I'll carve my bounty out of that boy. Where's Pinello? We're taking her back. The girl? Why keep the bait when you've landed the fish? We cut her loose on the way here and then off she ran crying like a babe. <sighs> Hey! After them! Hey, wait up! We'll not be able to take them all. Fight who we must, leave the rest. Interesting. I'm going the wrong way, right? I assume they cut us off from going the right way. 
don't know. Let's just take us back. Oh, I guess we gotta peace out. How do you feel about flying? Oh yeah, we're not we're not having that fight. Sorry team. We goofed. I think I murdered all these skeletons on the way through. Them. Oh, the skeletons did not stay murdered. Well, hopefully they don't know the difference between me and the enemies. I don't think there's actually infighting in this game, which is too bad. It feels like it'd be a cool thing for them to include. Don't lunge at me, bro. Oh, it would be cool if I could lead them over traps. I probably can, honestly. That's another good question in terms of what's allowed. Sort of related to infighting, I guess. Not me. I'm not fighting. This is a cool encounter that's like uniquely well suited to their combat style too. Rather than it being they follow. We've lost them. Much more running about with Bunga at my heels, and I'm apt to give up sky pirating altogether. R.I.P. Giant Chain. You get mini bone fragments out of the deal, though. And Dark Stone, for that matter. Alright, I didn't actually equip Bond with the new weapon that I got him license for. There you go. Put it to good use. Now that I have the silence spell, I'm more worried about having to use Mage Masher. What the Penella made for the city? I mean, why wouldn't she? It seemed like they were staying in the city, so it's not like she doesn't know the way back there. Or that there is the city nearby. Right. Nice in principle to the Gaman to not kill her though. We appreciate that. My chain for this. I was just kind of curious about him. I just think he's neat. I do have a cure set up. Nice. 
This is a slightly shorter dungeon than I was expecting. Nabana was a big thing to go through. I guess you had to do like the like uh jail part and then also the mines. But even the mines felt like they were pretty chunky on their own. I see you've been out walking without the company of your cortege, Lord Lhasa. Oh, no. We caught her wandering <laughs> out of the mines. You must take care with such undesirables about. I was kidnapped! Silence! If it is a crime to wander on one's own, then I too am guilty. Marquis. I trust that your estate can accommodate another guest. Why not? Judge Geese, I shall heed your counsel. I will not travel unaccompanied any longer. That was unexpected. Thank you, Penelo. Uh, of course. What's Penelo doing? We're cooked. And what's the deal with that Lamont? That's no Lamont. Lhasa Ferinas Solidor, fourth son to Emperor Gramis and brother to Vane. What? That kid? Do not worry. I believe he will treat her well. Nobody knows men like Fran does. Our purposes lead the same way, to Ondor. We must find means to approach him. The Marquis is channeling money to organizations opposing the Empire. We'll start there. Marquis Andor announced my execution two years ago. If news of my survival were to spread, the Marquis may find his position compromised. The men he's been funding bear little love for the Empire. They won't be thrilled to discover that rumors of your death were, in fact, greatly exaggerated. If we were to raise a clamor to that effect, we might just get their attention. Nothing to it. I'll just go around town spreading the word. How about this? Testify. I'm Captain Bosch von Rotzenberg of Dalmaska. What? Well, what do you think? That certainly qualifies as a clamor. All right, Vaughn, get to it. For the girl's sake, eh? Oh, and the more people around to witness your little performance, the better. If we're going to reach the Marquis, it's up to you. We'll be waiting here if you need us. What a bizarre little minigame, but all right, I'm here for it. Jason! You guys already heard about it. They know that I'm Captain Bosch von whatever his name was. Bosch lives! Why did only one Bujerbin heed me? Oh, what if I go on the sword? And I testify indoors. I can't. I'm the Bosch von Ronsenberg. Ronsenberg. How far does my voice I'm go? Captain Bosch von Rotzenberg of Dalmaska. Oh, the armor store has got to be. Or no, the the weapon store has got to be lit. I'm the Bosch von Rotzenberg. Wow, but no one came. I'm the Bosch von Rotzenberg. Just don't care down here. To be fair, Miner's End probably is like whatever. This is a very weird ploy of specifically getting Bond to be Bosch. Like, be Bosch. Quote unquote. Oh, this is the terrace or whatever, right? Couldn't go here earlier. That's cool. I will yell at people about being Bosch while I'm here.
Uh, if you're lucky, you might just become a stain on the ground. I'm Captain Bosch von Rotzenberg of Dalmaska. When it goes down over time? No! Okay, so I can't really just go around and chat people up while I've got the run of the city because uh, people will stop believing me. Oh, there's a, an additional layer. And talk smack with the guards around. But I wonder if I get big bo a big bump if I uh, do this around Imperials. Oh, the tavern's over here. Man, I want to do so much exploring, but I gotta fill my bar. I guess now that my bar is empty, though, I'm not... I'm not bound by that, huh? Hmm. Makes you think. Fool's coin. Fool's price. Is the plan? Do they have a branch here? The Ross residence. Rulon. Side quest, I guess. Keep an eye out for boys named Rulon. Pop it on the tavern. See if there's any cool hunts. And then keep talking. Performance. Oh, this is also probably a good place to grind out a rioting. Actually. Sorry, Mom. Everybody's like, no resistance here. Ho <laughs> ho. Oh yeah. Now we're cooking. I'm Captain Bosch von Rotzenberg of Dalmaska. There's a big city square. The guards? Oh, there's a guard. Uh... Can you hear me from here? I'm Captain Bosch. Really not. Okay. There's like a 
some unlimited area I'm on my Captain speech. Bosch. There's a bunch of people outside the tavern, too. I haven't told them that I'm Captain Bosch. I'm Captain Bosch von Rotzenberg of Dalmaska. Uh, what else are probably a good place? Oh yeah, I was gonna go to the weapon store because there's a jillion people in there. Also, it's good to know that the criers won't yell at me for this. I was gonna also see what happens if I yell around Imperials. Can you a soldier? No. I'm the Bosch von Ronsenberg. The armory, or the armor shop is dead zoos. Don't listen to Ondor's lies. Word status unheeded. Oh, damn it. I forgot. Nobody over here, though, right? I'm Captain Bosch von Ronsenberg of Dalmaska. I'm Captain Bosch von Ronsenberg of Dalmaska. Can't hear me over there. Forgot there's a garden here now. Whoops. Uh, can I go to the... Or maybe that little area over here is a square. Sure looks like a big public forum that I could yell in. I'm Captain Bosch von Ronsenberg oh, but I gotta watch out for the... Cop. I'm the Bosch von Ronsenberg! Oh, the the criers are like very good targets, I guess. I'm the Bosch von Rotzenberg. Don't listen to Ondor's lies. Shop keeps giving me bonuses. Bosch lives. Oh, but I could probably get this other prior. Don't listen to Ondor's lies. Hey, Buckethead. Mission accomplished. This is the one, Havaro. Says he's Captain Bosch, he does. <laughs> <laughs> he would sooner pass for the king. Yeah, I was... I knew he were no captain. <laughs> that was a mean trick to be playing. If a trickery it ended, it would end well enough. But why this boy? And why Captain Ronsenberg? An explanation is due, and I will hear it. The Empire's hounds grow passing bold indeed. A shame if they learnt the Marquis trafficked with the likes of you. Agents masquerading as guides a hideout at the back of a tavern? Not exactly earning high marks for originality, are we? Now you've done Wait. it! So Bash von Ronsenberg does yet live. We were smart enough to not have to be the one yelling at him, at least. I guess both ears, again, probably too well known to be like, it's me, Bosch. So Vaughn really is all right. I didn't think I'd ever get to see him again. You will join him soon. And until then, I shall see that you are kept from harm. Thank you. I am troubled. 
The Rabanaster Imperial Guard appear to have overstepped their bounds. I intend to speak on this with the Consul. What? Oh, it's not the Consul. Zane Solidor, the, the Consul, is my brother. Oh. <gasps> he means the Consul of, uh... The first duty of the Consul is to Robert maintain Austin. order in Damasca. My brother... My brother is not one given to failure. Perhaps things aren't going as well as they might be, but give him a little time and he will put things to rights. Be not troubled. My brother is a remarkable man. He frightens me. Why? I'm sorry. He is your brother. It's just, you don't understand how much we lost to the war. My friends. My parents. So you fear the Empire? Listen to me. The men of my family, we are taught to place the needs of others before those of our own. I will see that you are kept from harm. It is my duty to House Solidor. But how? How can I trust you? Because I give you my word. My brother would do no less. All right, I like I like where this kid's going. Well, he's young. He's idealistic. He doesn't presumably know how the sausage is made just yet. I knew there must be more to it, but to find you at the end of this tale, <laughs> ah, to see the Marquis's face when he learns of it, I should like nothing more. I would meet him and see for myself. How say you, my lord? There is little to be said. I shall arrange a meeting with the Marquis. We shall expect you at the estate. Nifty. Oh, that's why all these guys are hanging out in here. Okay. No fun allowed. That'd be messed up if they actually let you, or let other people get the marks first. Yeah, like all the resistance numbers. I gotta find that kid eventually. I guess there's also the kids that are supposed to like hiding from me in the Undercity. <laughs> guys just down for the count. Drunk cell, basically. Oh yeah, the estate is north from yeah that big junction. Uh, I kind of want to go check out this mark in the mines real quick though. At least see if the patron will tell me how far away it is. Oh yeah, I guess I can also see if I can find that, uh, what do you call it? The person who wants me to look into this 
major. Who's the sky grounds? Okay, I'll do that while I'm thinking about it. It's nice seeing them back up that tie though. They're like, oh, all the, all the priors live here. Oh, that also like makes sense of why. Um. They're where you get the big notoriety bumps. Because they're the people who actually will, go take that information and go to the resistance with it. You may not join us. Actually, Godzilla's origin story. And sight two, nice. Rock toys. I'll try it. I assume that, like the, like the cockatrice, is not to be uh, toyed with until later on down the line, but. Take a look. Oh, I need to stop at a shop too and sell like the gazillion. Um... Oh yeah, there's a guy. One of these guys in every one of the shops too. Once I realized that pattern, I should have gone to start going to shops more. But I just seeing the meter go down at all, even if it was fairly slowly, like put me into such a panic. Big money. Sorted leathers. Sure. Your little arrows. That sounds like some weird magic stuff. Oh, you can get bonus attack power, and I assume elements and stuff as well, as you Back into cooler kinds of armor. Assume this is just lacking the license. After up here, right? But I guess I can use it to explore if nothing else. Make it expensive down here. Oh, 
Ooh, hello. And hello again. I'll take it. That's cool if remedies are like a build your own thing though. You have the gambit for them. I like that. I like it very much. Maybe Balthier will just be my weird gimmicky technic fan. Whoa. Oh, nice. There's some cool stuff in Technic Land. Addle? Addle mentioned? Oh, yeah, Technics are like, yeah, a lot of things that would later get folded into Blue Magic. Successive, oh, I assume successive hits of numerology. That's actually really funny. I like a lot of this. Ah, oh, you tickets are tight. All right, all right, all right. Ball theory, you may have a feature in the party yet now that I've found out how fun techniques are. I guess I would have seen them in the store when they became available anyway. But still. Much, much to aspire to. I should probably go buy a better shield for... Her. Uh... Bosh. Uh, oh, I'm probably not gonna remember if I have to think about it all the way from the mines, but... We will try. Oh, self-status reflect is actually cool, because then you can throw reflect on yourself and then be like, once you've got reflect on, start shooting yourself with magic and you're going good. Home. Yeah, he's got a name. Your shaft splits in two. Let's give it a shot, shall we? Do the shaft split in two. I assume they mean here. Yeah, where is uh, site two? Uh, the one up here? That guy, okay. That's not too bad to get to. I guess now we have to do it without the infinite potions of. Um, Lamont, quote unquote. Yeah. No 
Okay. No one in trouble. Oh, but I will fight these bats. The big thing is not going to fight back in the meantime. Uh-oh. I'm in danger. Oh, not that much danger. Block turns out to be a good stat. But do it. No! I don't such a thing. I guess we can probably just run away until it drops aggro. But I do want the goods first. Leave me alone. Okay, dead. Yeah, it feels like some of the biggest benefits to leveling are just, uh, what do you call it? Oops, right. Um, more HP and MP. I assume this deck games are, games are probably kind of nominal. I'm sure they're fine, but given the way that the license board works, I have to assume that they end up being the thing that really gets a weight of the heaviest. It's a bat down here. If so, I will kill it with a chain. It's not the bat. That's not a bat. I think the chain is not long for this world, because I'm soon to be entering a skeleton territory. Ah, but we did get one one last bat for the road. I forgot about the ceiling bat. Yeah. Ooh, and another bat. Oh yeah, but it's like surrounded by skeleton secretly. Came to me. I was gonna say Fran should be able to yes. grab it for us. Did not need to. Mm. Follow me. Follow my lead. We get attention to that. Goody. Goody gumdrops. That was 15 when we get the. No heals, I guess. Oh yeah, you can only use your uh, mist or overdrive or whatever when you've got full MP, I think. That's got like a weird thing, and it drains all your MP too. I guess, no, it's not that weird. It's actually kind of cool. Let me kill this thing first. Uh, I guess it's gonna have to of this. Oh, moly. Be above our pay grade, unfortunately. Yeah, I feel like we need to spell. Oh my goodness, I do. Bye, bye. Which means that the uh, 
Rock Toys is almost certainly more than we're bargaining for. Magic is pretty slow, so. It's cute, yeah. I think most of the enemies should stay dead though while we're on our way out. Oh, we got a couple of surprise contenders on the bridge. That's okay. Oh, there was a trap there. I didn't think there was. Oh, he's got a gambit to potion. Use potions. I remember setting that up. But it makes sense. It's a good gambit to have. I probably want to have like a cure gambit for like lower HP. For like sub 40% and then a potion gambit for like sub 25 or something like that. Maybe we oh, we kept the chain alive though. Uh, I'll bring the plan. We'll get the chain on our way out. Consolation prize, I guess. Yeah, the skeletons, I think, it's a crummy drop rate. Maybe because they're so easy, like, they make it so easy to chain them in here. But I feel like I should have been seeing double windstones way more. I think people slow down their DPS so much, though. Holy smokes. I got a little heal bomb. It doesn't give you MP, which is a little bit surprising. Oh, that's right. I remember seeing those guys before when I was hunting for more bats to chain. We'll go this way then. Keep the, keep the bats coming. Keep the drops coming. Well, I didn't see this until after a couple of times. That's handy. Oh, it's an AoE heal. Boo. So they can use it on each other. Eat that. You see nothing. Target that would explain it. Which is made clear. Cool. I thought there might be a toast.
We didn't get like any drops from this, huh? Yeah, I feel like Dispel is just a uh, low-key mandatory thing for a lot of these higher level marks. They love to have buffs on them. That seemed like a huge pain in the butt to fight. Alright, that seems like a good place to stop. We'll kick into the next big story jag next time.